In today's video, man, I'm just simply reposting another case study to show you what a woman looks like and sounds like, you know, when she is, uh, you know, accepting her choices and looking within herself, taking a good look into the mirror as to why she has some of the problems she has. And this is a single mother, you know, telling the truth about not only single motherhood, but this I don't need a man mindset. And she pretty much, you know, says some things in here that you don't hear a lot of women say. And she pretty much says some things in here. And she pretty much says some things in here that you don't hear a lot of women say. And this is truly when you remove all that boss chick energy, all of that diva energy, all of that bad B-I-T-C-H energy, you take away the eyelashes, the makeup, the hair, the sass, this is what's left. Let's talk about it. to love me. I want somebody I can be vulnerable with. The problem is, and when I cry, y'all, because I'm saying I'm crying, y'all, because it's like a release right now. But the problem for me, y'all, is that all the relationships that I had with men were not about love. It was about survival for me. I know how to fuck. I know how to cook. I know how to clean. I know how to seduce a man. I do not know how to love a man. And then, to have a son because of those choices that I was making y'all and I got pregnant really really fast I got pregnant within 90 days of knowing my baby daddy and we don't talk about this shit because it's embarrassing and it hurts it fucking hurts and I'm mad with me I'm not mad at men I'm not mad at I'm not mad at my life I'm, I'm, I'm mad at me because I don't know how to fix it me. I don't know how to fix it. That's, that's accountability. That's the shit that hurts. It's realizing that, hey, I got some shit with me that I don't know how to fucking fix. And in turn, because I don't know how to fix that shit, I'm fucking up other people around me. 